Hello again. I just realized it's day 61 with my hers leather bag and I hadn't posted a two month update. So I wanted to do a quick video because I feel like it's changed a lot this month. Um, let me get in closer. Um, so July in Texas is super hot and um, we have spent a lot of time this summer going to pool parties, um, splash pads, um, anything outside with, since we have three boys that are little they like to be outside constantly so it has gotten a lot darker you could see the tan lines there from just being out in the sun with me um it got rained on with this and it's got water spots um it's gotten a lot darker it's real dry around the edges actually last night i had treated it with some chamberlain's leather milk number one because it was so dry looking, but um, it's still kind of the same. But um, as you can see, I don't baby this bag at all. Um, I'm not like ex extra rough on it, but I'm just kind of, you know, I want it to show what it's going through. So um, I am fine with how it's looking and I think it's gonna be awesome by the end of the year. I have um, a trip to Florida next weekend and I plan to take it with me to the beach, so it might look quite different by the end of month three. We'll see. Um, also this month, I picked up this tiny little satchel from Peg and All. It's called the Small Hunter. And I actually already had this bag. I had bought it for Courtney um, in a different colorway called Moss Green. And it had like a, like a light brown or a tan colored hardware or leather, I mean. Um, but then I ended up selling it because she wasn't using it and I thought it looked too small on me. So um, I went on eBay and I found this one. And the only reason I bought it on eBay and not from Peganol directly is because you can't get this kind anymore with the antique leather. Um, this was like old rifle slings. Um, and I really love this color truffle. So when I saw the listing, they have two sizes. They have the Hunter, which is 10 inches tall and the small hunter which is eight inches tall so the listing was for the the bigger one and it even had the original tags and the tag says um you know truffle hunter satchel um so when i got it i was like oh man this is the exact same size that i literally just sold days before um but then i realized it's actually perfect for me because i really only wanted it to carry um like very few things with me like whenever I don't want to carry my actual big bag like to the movies or to the grocery store or whatever so this is actually perfect and it has been the exact size I needed so um the inside's got one pocket that they have um this is like fabric from the 1900s so that's pretty cool um I have my saddleback leather bear trap coin purse my new Chic Sparrow um, Earl Grey pocket size notebook. I just got this today. And I have one I haven't started yet, one that's like financial stuff, and one that is all my treadmill workouts for years. <laughs> um, and I have also in the back pocket here, my favorite um, aromatherapy oil stuff, orange ginger, and some my favorite drink, which is Crystal Light, and some single-use Purell wipes. And I usually have my phone in here too, and um, I used to have a pen. Is that a Tootsie Roll? Wow. Score. Okay. Um, so that's all. But um, this was a recent... Um, purchase I think like last week and no maybe a week and a half ago because I took it on a vacation out of town um, last weekend we went to see my parents and it was perfect so um, this is my setup right now this one every day for sure no matter what and then this one if I go somewhere short um, where, I, where I don't want to take my big bag but that's all I'll post another update um, after month three and we'll see how it's looking then but hope you all are doing well bye